tell me um, about my condition and uh, about my family and actually no, about my life and I'm so, going to my husband workplace so I can pick him and go to the insane and pump school. Hi guys, um, I'm happy today. Today is finally the day where I'm going to the orientation for the insulin pump. So I'm ready for it. I'm like kind of anxious too because I want to know everything right now, but I still need to wait. Um, today is kind of late for me. Um, I start my day very late. Um, I don't have any makeup. My hair is like, I do my hair, but it's like not completely I was doing a uh, in the laboratory some blood test for my next appointment and that's why I'm here here no, I'm not sure um, I going to have something to eat now and then I'm going to the library because I have to return some food and prepare for the big moment my orientation I'm very happy to wait for it and see how it goes
what I have to do with them and what I want to do with my video because I really want to expose my life with diabetes and this is a video that I really wanted to do because it's my start, my journey with my new insulin pump or anything in this new journey and obviously I want to record it so it's something that I was planning to do I don't know how I'm gonna record everything and have it exposed but anyway I'm working on it um other thing that I want to do is like I really need like have content for all the videos all the weeks right now I only have one day that I'm posting the videos so it not supposed to be difficult I know some people like only post one month after the month but I really want to deal with my schedule every Tuesday at between 10 and 10 30 and post one video that is the right now that is my goal um, and I'm thinking about next, um, the next month in August I'm thinking about in August I'm really thinking about um, having another day for videos it's not gonna be every week but I'm thinking about oh my god I, I say that word like thousand times I wanna have a video in Spanish every month even only one I'm gonna record that I'm not this I'm not just deciding I'm gonna do like a day now live in Spanish or I'm gonna do like for example the diabetic update video do that one on Spanish it's not that the exact um, video but I mean I'm like a uh, informant video or a teaching video or for example when I, I'm preparing my my story video and when I have those doing two in Spanish that was that is what I'm thinking so I'm preparing all that I need to figure out how can I do it and still working working and see what's going on uh, I really want to like really expose more about me like with the diabetes it's been like a lot when I have it and I never have it in control I'm only having for some time when I have one of my insulin pump but it's the only moment that I have it in control in my life that I have to change um, to the pants from something that is not good for me and I still work working very hard when you are sometimes I get tired and I just wanna get like library leave the books to my makeup I did my bacon when I finished eating my lunch and then now I'm still having time for I need to stop in CBS and look for some street because I don't have enough for this week I had to buy them and then I'm going to my husband workplace so I can pick him and go to the Insulin pump school and orientation, um, and that's what I'm gonna do. I'm trying to find maybe a CVS close by, but um, I think they're not close by. <laughs> so maybe I try to reach my husband work first, and then see if I can find any any CVS on the way. I'm not promoting. CBS is just my meter 
is a CBS brand Bluetooth meter. So that is where I had to find new streets. And then anyway, I'm gonna do that and then I still gonna record. I don't know how I gotta do it in the orientation and the school. I don't know what rules they have. Maybe I can record there because they don't they have that rule. But it's something that happens sometime in this kind of stuff. I'm gonna try to take photos anyway and put some stuff and maybe with a voiceover I can explain a little a little bit or when I finish I can give you all the information that they give me um if I can do that with my husband, I can do the video with him and see what is his opinion of what he likes more in there. So let's see what happens. Oh my god, I have a lot to talk about and now I can talk a little bit about it because I could process all the information I had like a lot of information and like new stuff and new things to think about it and we could heard about two insulin pump and two company of insulin pump i was going there with an idea of what i want um but i learned a lot about a new pump so that it was amazing that was amazing and well it's not that all the pumps are good or bad or anyway on um, some of them are good but it's the best pump of your own situation so that is what you need to decide um we have to like two companies orientating and the first one was insulet of Anipal they give us like a dummy to practice i didn't use it because they give they give us this so we can feel how it, how it feels the tape and everything but i used to have omnipod and i know how it feels it's awesome that the, this one is smaller than the one that i have when i used to have omnipod so i love that and I'm deciding for Omnipod is the insulin pump that I want. Um, now it's gonna be a long process to um, all the insurance process and having all the new stuff of Omnipod too. And we need still needing um, a lot of stuff to learn. And I really noticed that I really need to re-educate myself. It's been a long time without uh, a class or an education or a forum where I can have like a real education about diabetes. I noticed that today when they start talking about a lot of small words and stuff or different stuff, things, small stuff, things and details that I didn't know um well and now I not I know that I have to relearn all that I and mean, that is something that I'm gonna work and I'm trying to figure it out and everything so like I was telling you um I like Omnipod the best for me first because it's wireless or without the tube um the tube was something that i it doesn't work for me at the time so it's something that i love um we have to the orientation of the another insulin pump that i really like it i really like that pump oh give me a moment and is the Tislim S2. I really like this one, but between the Omnipod and this one, 
um, I gotta go with the Omnipod um, first because even this uh, the Omnipod is plastic this one is in aluminium it's heavy for me I think it's heavy and I think this not gonna work for me the better feature that is this is having like is really like engaging engaging me is this is the fact of the task of the part that work with the task on but that is something that I can still do with the omnipod and the omnipod every time I know that they can get damaged or have some error or something and um well I just take out the the pod and change it I have the experience before that if I my insulin pump get damaged because it's a one machine I had to wait for a replacement and I don't have something to work with during that time um, I just started my process to have the desk come it was the first time that I have some information how to work with it or how to order the desk come I'm hoping that I can I can have my desk come cover I'm hope they give me the G6 desk come and I start working with that and then learn the process with the new insulin pump with the desk come on so I can really know what is happening and I can really know how is my sugar working during the day um all the co-payment and all that is something that well i gonna have it in the process but like i i say um other thing that i like about the t slim is that they can have more insulin inside the pump than the only part that's true but well, at the end for me it's more important that it doesn't have to pump the tube and that if it gets damaged because the cannula or not not exactly like that um if the computer of the omnipod it get damaged i only need to change the part and that's it um that is something that i don't want to like get worry and that's why I think Omnipod is gonna be my best option right now and um, well that is my update and I'm really happy I'm very surprised all the information that they give me I'm very happy that my husband understand a lot of the process and that my mind and his mind is in the same way we have the same opinion of the different pumps and even if he's not who is like wearing the pump I'm very happy that he had the same opinion that I have and I feel supportive with him and he is like um financial financial mind <laughs> every time he was like asking about the prices even if it's not covered with the insurance how he can work with it and um he's asking all the process and um what documents we have to fill and everything so i'm very happy that he's doing that part because i'm good at math but i don't really like it or I like it but not in that way and um, sometimes I struggle with financials so and he's very good at it and I'm happy that he can like process all that information and give me all that information back but process more easy for me and I can understand it and seeing what is better how we can do better for me well i think that's it for today and thank you for seeing my video please don't forget to subscribe 
write any comment that you want to give me about this um anyway if you think that omnipod is not a good option or maybe give me why you decide for another um pump write it down i can still like reading your comments and i really think that both of the options of the day they were very good Medtronic couldn't be there so I didn't have any like orientation about them but I know they offering like different kind of insulin pump and I know that all the people that are were interested in that insulin pump or a Medtronic pump they were giving like private orientation of it so um I think it was very good and this is a big step I'm very confident that um, everything is gonna be better for me so I don't I cannot explain my happiness right now I know I'm more controlled now but when I go outside of that office where like all smile and all love and love and a lot of happiness and my husband were like we were glowing and it was like oh my god finally we can have somebody that understand how need how how much i need this and how much i can have it i know maybe because is their company is their day business well that is their job but no still they're doing that because they have somebody that had diabetes and they're working there because they know somebody that had diabetes or have somebody close to them that had diabetes i they understand one of the guys the one that worked for the company of the t slim he was diabetic that himself so and they he explained his own experience with the pump and how he changed and why he changed and this is a big deal too because they have like upgrades and all that and that is big because sometimes when you have like new technology you have to change everything and they don't need to do that because they can only connect that pump i don't know how to process and that is something that they explain when you decide for that pump but you can have some connection and have some upgrade to the insulin pump and you don't need to um like buy a new pump and that's awesome too and well i really now is really all the information that i have i know it's a lot and i don't have all my all my ideas like organized but like i was telling you i'm very happy this is a big step for me and i know that with this my desk gum or when i have it and my new insulin pump and all the new stuff and details in the insulin pump i know i'm gonna be better and i'm happy that i can finally start fulfilling that goal in my life.